Go. Oh, it's starting to reflect. <laughs> Home Science Tools graciously gifted me their Science Unlocked box for Wonder, and Wonder is a K through two grade level, and so this is mainly for my little kids to use, and I can't wait to to open it up. So um, let's get to it. All right, so hopefully I got this all set up. I tried to adjust my volume on this new camera, and I'm not too sure if I did it right, but whatever. We've tried a lot of science kits, and. I will be honest, there's only a couple that I actually really truly love. I love Science Unlocked because it's kind of like an all-in-one curriculum um, type of, like a unit study type of box. So everything that you need is included pretty much. I mean, there's some like household items that you may need to get, but other than that, everything is here. I don't need to go scrambling for all the different materials. And I don't need to, like if I'm using like a different type of curriculum, and then I don't need to go onto home science tools and like look for all the pieces that I need because it's cheaper to buy there than it is to buy elsewhere. I mean, you could buy on Amazon and stuff, but I'd rather um, purchase my products from a, you know, a local US company. <laughs> so this box is Blast Off. It's Ready, Set, Rocket burn, burst, stomp, and blow to make four different mini rockets go. And so we have learning goals right here. And teach, tells you how to use the kit or what's packed in here. Safety warnings. There are three different levels. There's wonder, which is K to two, accelerate grades three to seven, and then launch grades eight to 12. And I just, you know, I love science, but I don't like all of the getting all the experiment stuff ready to go. You know, that's that's the part that is sticky for me. So Science Unlocked just kind of makes it easier for me. I do like, the, like, like I said, like, we've tried other different science kits and they're awesome, but they there's like really no curriculum to go with it. It's not like um, there's no unifying unit of study, I guess, <laughs> that we're doing. And so I really like Science Unlocked for that. So uh, next year, we're cutting down on our kits and we're pretty much just sticking to science unlocked for the kids. And then plus, why make your life harder? Make your life easier. <laughs> don't make your life harder. Um, like don't stress out about science and stuff, you know? And then you can supplement, like whatever, if you wanna go deeper than what science unlocked um, offers, then you can supplement. Like there's no perfect curriculum out there. You're always gonna need more information, especially if your kids like are inter interested in something and then you're gonna have to dive in and get more info about it. So anyways, I love Science Unlocked. So it comes with a teacher's guide here, blast off. And it's gonna take a total of eight hours to complete this box. So we would probably divide this up into, you know, each activity is like one day I would do, right? Activity one, activity two, three, four, five, six. I mean, you could do split up more days. Like here, they split up into 15 days. And we kind of dive deep when we do science. Like we don't do science every day. And 15 days would take us, what are we, like three months? <laughs> I don't want to do three months. So we'll complete this in probably a month is the plan. So we'll see about that. We are going on vacation, so we may need to take this with us and I'll have to film while we're away, which is totally fine. Activity one is traveling tea bag. Activity two, fizz pop and push. Activity three, super stomp. Activity four, straw power. Activity five, space solution. And activity six, boost your knowledge. And so here, they have some like discussion questions to think about it. They're discussion questions to, to talk about stuff with your kids because um, like I know a lot of folks out there think that rigor means like showing proof or evidence that learning is happening but rigor is really more than that it's like critical thinking right and so how do you develop cr critical thinking by asking questions and discussing <laughs> those questions um, and so it's not really to me about what's written down in a worksheet or a booklet. So here's a student workbook that your kids can use. Again, this is for grades K to two, so everything is simplified. But even though it's grades K to two, I am gonna have my oldest son like help out 
with the kids and do this with them. You know, they still struggle. My little ones still struggle with writing. So I may have him write down the information while the other two do the experiments. So really easy to do. And I think my kids are gonna have a fun time. And really, I think I can, we can finish this quicker than 15 days, no problem. And there's a glossary to end. And then, that's it. So here's activity six, boost your knowledge. And so these are like kind of extra activities that you can do. So we have a marble run, stomp size, and space stuff. So if you want to dive a little bit deeper, so not necessary, but you can. All right, so I'm just going to go through the supplies right now. So we have a tray, we have these little peanuts, Alka-Seltzer, tape, paper clips. It's just nice to have like all the stuff, extra stuff. Like, I mean, yeah, I have film canisters sitting around, but I have film in them. So, you know, it's nice to have like an empty film canister. <laughs> crayons, we have a ton of crayons, but I mean, I get it. Matches is something that we're actually out of. Um, we have this tube here with a fitting at the end. We have some tea. Look at this. Looks like a measuring tape, like some sort of bearing ball thing, a rubber band. Here we have coarse sand. We have some pebbles. A straw. Some more tubing. A styrofoam cup. And a bottle here. And that's it. So that's everything that's inside here. Um, so I guess we'll get started with the experiments. So okay, right now my kids are outside taking care of the chickens. So we're gonna have to wait a bit until they're done. But once they come in, then we'll get started with the first activity and I can't wait. Oh, and if you're new here, I'm Suen and I'm a homeschool blogger and mentor and I share all things about homeschooling and slow living and slow travel and everything like that. And I'm so happy to have you here. Now, I still haven't bought our curriculum yet, but I do plan on ordering the Science Unlocked kits for my kids um, this year as well. We still have some leftover from the Accelerate for my older son to finish up. So once he's done with that, then we're gonna move on into the next phase, which is launch, which I'm super excited about. I think it's launch. Yeah, it's launch. <laughs> If science is a struggle for you, I really recommend Science and Luck. Like, all these opinions are my own. Like, yes, they gave me this box, but I am happy to work with them um, on this because I really do love Science Unlocked. You've probably seen my other video about it that my son, my older son, completed a box as well. And we just we just really enjoyed it a lot and you know ended up purchasing the curriculum and we use it. <laughs> That's, that's the best kind of curriculum you have is the one that you actually use. Because sometimes we buy a curriculum and then we don't use it because it's just too hard to gather all the supplies or it's just not what we thought it would be or our kids aren't into it. So this I love because hands-on science experiments. I mean, that's what makes science fun is all the experiments and, and everything that you do and not so much, you know, reading out of a textbook or, or even reading a book you know, even if it is an interesting book, it's not the same as getting your hands in the clay, so to speak, and just really, you know, seeing science in action, basically. And they also have like a Facebook group. If you're on Facebook, I try to avoid that. But if you are on Facebook and have to, want to join their group, you can. And I'm assuming that you just share ideas and stuff. I don't know. Or maybe if you have questions. Is that what it's for? I don't know. I'm not too big in Facebook groups, so. Okay, let's get to it. <laughs> Good a day as any 
to start the rebuilding of life. The roads that lay open are many. When the old one's gone under the knife, and I can feel the sun on my skin. Acid. Mm. That's the packet right next to the crayons. Left, 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 left. There you go. I didn't see it because it's not this okay. nice seat. You need masking tape. Tape. And you're gonna need some water. Mm. Stuff all those. It's gonna be hot. So it has 
go. It's, it's gonna be right here. I've got butt 11 times, exactly. I've got butt. His name is Ross and this is the first ever rock he ever done. Fuck you, Megan. This is an antenna. I, the camera, that's Cooper. Cooper! I think they gave us a movie.